So today we're jumping into a hot topic that's really shaking up the AI scene. We're talking AGI or artificial general intelligence. It's not just coming, it's already here and the impact is huge. So let's talk about something big that's been buzzing around. Elon Musk's huge lawsuit against OpenAI, the very company he helped start. Now he's suing them. The reason? He says OpenAI has drifted from its original goal, focusing more on making money, especially with Microsoft in the picture. It's pretty shocking. OpenAI was meant to be this open source dream, working on AGI to tackle big challenges. But Musk believes this vision is fading, all for profit. And Musk isn't just talking, he's pointing out real issues, like the secrecy around OpenAI's latest work, including the mysterious GPT-4. He thinks OpenAI's shift towards making money is betraying their initial mission and could limit AGI's potential to help everyone. Why should we care about this lawsuit? Because it's not just about a company dispute, it's about the future of AGI and its huge potential to change our world. Who controls this technology, who it benefits, and how it impacts us all is at stake. Now, when we talk about AGI, we're venturing into a territory that's been, up until now, largely theoretical. AGI represents a form of intelligence that's not just about performing specific tasks or learning within a narrow scope. No, AGI is the big league. The ability to understand, learn, and apply knowledge across a wide range of tasks just like a human. And according to the ripples being sent across the tech world by Elon Musk's lawsuit, we're not just inching closer to AGI, we might already be standing at its doorstep. Central to Musk's argument, and honestly, what's sending shockwaves through the community is the mention of a model referred to as QAR. Now the details are shrouded in a bit of mystery, but the implication is clear. This QAR model is posited as having a stronger claim to AGI than anything we've seen before. Think about that for a second. If true, we're talking about a leap from highly capable AI systems like GPT-3 and GPT-4, which have already dazzled the world with their linguistic prowess, to something that fundamentally changes the game. GPT-4's capabilities, while impressive, still fall within the realm of what we've come to expect from advanced AI models. It can write essays, solve complex problems, even create art that stirs the soul. But AGI is a different beast. It implies a level of cognitive function that mirrors human intelligence, crossing the threshold from performing tasks to possessing an understanding of the world around it. And Musk's lawsuit hints that we might just be on the cusp of this revolutionary breakthrough. But why isn't this front page news everywhere? Well, according to Musk, it's all about secrecy. The development of GPT-5, and more so this mysterious QAR model, has been tightly under wraps. And it's this secrecy that Musk is challenging. He's alleging that the shift towards profit, the exclusive deals and partnerships are not just altering the course of open AI, but potentially withholding from humanity a technology that could redefine our future. In today's fast moving digital world, where the next big thing, AGI is just around the corner, keeping our online lives private and secure is more important than ever. It's within this context that the value of IP vanish a leading VPN service becomes unequivocally clear. As we dive deep into the world of AGI and all the big questions it brings up, it's super comforting to know that IP Vanish has got our backs. It wraps your internet connection in a layer of strong encryption, making sure everything you do online from checking your emails to banking stays private and away from nosy eyes. No matter what gadget you're using, be it a Windows laptop, a Mac, your iPhone, an Android device, or even an Amazon Fire Stick, IP Vanish makes getting a secure and unrestricted internet connection a breeze. It's not just about getting around geoblocks to access content from all over the globe. It's about making a stand for your privacy and safety in a world that's watching more closely than ever. With over 2,200 servers spread out over more than 75 locations worldwide, IP Vanish lives up to its promise of keeping no logs and using the strongest encryption out there to keep your online activity under wraps. At a time when the awe and concerns around AGI are growing, making sure we're protected online is key. And here's the best part. You can give IP Vanish a try completely risk-free for 30 days. If you decide it's the right fit for you, there are some great deals to be had on their yearly plan. So check out the link in the video description and see how IP Vanish can help keep your digital life safe and sound. Now. Let's pause and consider the implications. If AGI is indeed within our grasp, if OpenAI has crossed that elusive line, the potential is both exhilarating and terrifying. AGI could solve problems that have baffled humanity for centuries, 
from medical breakthroughs to environmental solutions. But it also raises profound ethical questions. Who controls AGI? How do we ensure it's used for the benefit of all, not just a select few? And most crucially, how do we safeguard against the existential risks that come with a technology capable of outsmarting us? These aren't just rhetorical questions, they're the very issues at the heart of Musk's lawsuit and the broader debate it's ignited. All right, so here's where things get even more interesting. Microsoft's involvement with OpenAI isn't just a footnote in this story, it's a central chapter. When OpenAI transitioned from its nonprofit roots into a capped profit entity, Microsoft was right there backing them with a whopping $1 billion investment. But honestly, that was just the beginning. This partnership has since evolved into a multi-year, multi-billion dollar alliance, especially following the launch of ChatGPT. Now, why does this matter? Well, because it signifies a deep and strategic fusion between one of the world's largest tech giants and an AI research lab that's on the brink of AGI breakthroughs. Microsoft's not just a passive investor, they're an active participant in shaping the trajectory of OpenAI's research and, by extension, the development of AGI. What's truly fascinating here and somewhat concerning is how this relationship might influence the direction and accessibility of AGI technology. With Microsoft's vast resources and commercial interests at play, there's a real worry that the original mission of OpenAI to democratize AGI for the benefit of humanity could be overshadowed by profit-driven motives. This dynamic is at the heart of Musk's lawsuit, highlighting fears that AGI's potential might be gated behind commercial agreements rather than shared openly for the greater good. Now let's dive a bit deeper into this transformation of OpenAI. When OpenAI was founded, it was heralded as a beacon of hope in the AI world. Its mission was clear and noble, to ensure that AGI would be developed safely and its benefits distributed evenly across humanity. The dream was big, AGI as a common good, not a commercial weapon. But fast forward to today and the landscape looks dramatically different. OpenAI's pivot to a capped profit model and its increasingly close ties with Microsoft have raised quite a few eyebrows. The essence of the concern here is not just about the profit motive, it's about accessibility and transparency. GPT-5, and potentially QAR, represent monumental leaps forward in AI capabilities, but the details of these advancements are shrouded in secrecy. As we grapple with these ethical considerations, a parallel narrative is unfolding the global race for AGI supremacy. Nations and corporations alike are pouring resources into AI research, each vying to unlock AGI's transformative power first. This is a strategic maneuver in a world where AGI could redefine economic, military, and geopolitical dynamics. OpenAI, backed by Microsoft, finds itself at the forefront of this race, propelled not just by research excellence, but by significant financial investment. The implications are vast. The entity that achieves AGI first will possess a technology with the potential to reshape the world in its image. This prospect raises urgent questions about governance, regulation, and international cooperation to ensure AGI's benefits are widely distributed and its risks mitigated. This global race, while fueling rapid advancements, also amplifies the stakes. The quest for AGI supremacy must be tempered with a commitment to shared goals and principles. So here we are, standing at the precipice of a new era in human history. The advent of AGI is not a distant future event, it's happening now. We're talking about a, a future where machines can learn, understand, and interact with the world in a way that's indistinguishable from humans. We are literally creating entities that could, in many ways, surpass human intelligence. Imagine AGI solving complex global challenges like curing diseases that have plagued humanity for centuries. AGI could revolutionize industries, create new forms of art, and even help us understand the mysteries of the universe in ways we can't currently fathom. The lawsuit between Elon Musk and OpenAI serves as a stark reminder of the challenges and complexities involved in bringing AGI into the world. It's a call to action for all of us to pay attention, to educate ourselves, and to participate in shaping the future of this technology. AGI has the potential to be one of humanity's greatest achievements, but only if we approach it with wisdom, foresight, and a commitment to the common good. As we conclude this discussion, I invite you to share your thoughts and feelings about the AGI era. What excites you? What concerns you? And how do you think we should navigate the challenges ahead? The conversation doesn't end here, it's just beginning. And it's a conversation that needs every one of us. Thank you for joining me on this journey through the complexities of AGI and its impact on our world.
The future is unfolding before us, and together we have the opportunity to shape it in ways that reflect our highest aspirations for humanity. Let's make it count.